Hey, what's going on, YouTube gang? It's Mellow DFS coming to you live and direct here to give you my fave five plays for today's nine game main slate. I right, hope everybody's having an amazing day. Feel free to smash that like. Also, subscribe for your boy. And if you don't mind, press that bell icon so you always stay notified for future videos. Let's get into it. Now, going to my two pitches for today. Like Joey Lachesi going against Pittsburgh. Definitely like the San Diego stat for today. All right. 31.2 projection. 8,500 on FanDuel. Looking about 91 on DraftKings. 5 for 24 and hits against Pittsburgh. So, like this play. All right. 208 bad and average against the Pirates. So I love this spot for him today with good upside. Past two games against Pittsburgh, he had 36.5 in the past two games against them. All right, last game he had a 46 fantasy point game on FanDuel, 34. 41 48 in the past five so he has great upside man so i love this spot for him in this price another guy i'm looking at is michael pineda all right nine for 40 hits all right so love this spot for him against the royals at 6700 on FanDuel on both FanDuel and DraftKings 29.9 projection play so love this knowing that he has good upside against Kansas City all right 40 34 in the past two games as well had 34 last game so shows upside and shows that he could do damage against the Royals at this cheap spot man so on DraftKings 67 is a steal so you can add on some big hits and also a uh, top tier pitcher as well now let's look to our first baseman position for today like Freddie Freeman going against Washington with uh, I think it's what was his name his name is Austin Voth now he's still a mediocre pitcher in my opinion they give up a lot against lefties um, but he his best hits is against lefties um, pitches against lefties but like Freddie Freeman, he's been on a roll. It was a 10 over and under play. Even if he was to sit down, he still has good upside against Washington as he had 36 last game, 10 um, the past two games against Washington. 28 and 219 fantasy point games. All right, these, uh, uh, these points are on FanDuel prices. So if I was to switch on DraftKings, they would look differently. But on FanDuel, these are great FanDuel uh uh, fantasy points on that matter. So I love this play for him today. Freddie Freeman. It's a good spot to target. I love the Atlanta. I like the Atlanta Braves stack for today. So something you want to take a look at. Alright, let's go to our next play. Looking into the second baseman position. I like Ozzy Osby's. Alright, 25% advantage play against switch hitters. And Voth's worst hit is against uh, switch hitters. So, he's in a great spot. 3,400 on FanDuel. 44 on DraftKings at 8.9 projection play. So, he hasn't uh, went against Voth, but he should definitely go in on this. He had 18 last game. He had 3 in the past 2 games against... Uh, Washington, but he should have a good upside as he had 38 28 in the past five games. So, love the spot for Albies today. All right, let's go to our next spot. Let's go to our third baseman. I like Manny Machado, man, going against Pittsburgh. 44 advantage play. Now, he only had a small sample size of two plate appearances, but he has 50 500 bad and average against them. But, love this play. He hits his best hits against lefties. And Stephen Ball is going to have issues with righties. So, Manny Machado, I like the San Diego stack, like I stated. All right, so you can definitely load up on some, like, a, a Tatis and um, even Reyes. And so, love the spot for him today. 3,600 on FanDuel. But you're looking at 47 on DraftKings. Steep spot. Um, you can't afford him in this play. I like Josh Donaldson as well. 3,000 on Fan duel, all right. 44 on fan, uh, DraftKings, 11.1 projection play, 23 advantage play against right hand pitchers, and Voth's worst hits against righty. So he's in a great spot as well. Like I said, he should have a good spot. Love Atlanta. All right, so hopefully they could just <laughs> the DFS guys could align with these plays because Atlanta's in a smart, smart, uh, great spot today. All right. Let's go to our next spot at outfielder. All right, my guy for today is Christian Village, man. All right, in a balling spot against Cincinnati with Del Scafani. 
36 advantage play with his worst hits against lefties and Christians. Best is against righties. You know the recipe for success. 7 for 15, 467 batting average with two home runs as well. 1.5 OPS against him. So he hits his best hits and he connects well with them. So I love this spot knowing that he's going to ball out 41 40, um, 41 22 6 in the past three games against Cincinnati. So he has great upside in this play. All right, another guy you could target is Ronald Acuna Jr. Like I said Atlanta's in a great spot 4,200 on FanDuel, 12.6 uh, uh, projection play, 48 on DraftKings. Like I said, gonna have issues with righties and his best hit. Well, in general, he's a great hitter. So his best hit is against lefties, but he still has a great average against righties. All right, with his weighted OPS. So I love him in this spot as well. 12-3 in the past two against Washington, but nonetheless, still in an amazing spot. As you can see, 31-44 in the past five games. All right, let's get some cheap spots. Because I know y'all love cheap, man. So let's go to some cheap spots, see what we can look at. All right. Ugh. Let's go down this list. Like I said, friend Mel Reyes, man. 29 is a cheap spot on FanDuel. 10.1 projection play. Looking about 32. I'm sorry. So you're looking about 4,000 on DraftKings. 33% advantage play against Steven Vaughn. Best hit against lefties in this play for him today. So Fran Reyes in a great position at a 10, a 9.5 over and under for them. He's been on a slump lately, but Hopefully he can bounce back into this average three plate appearances. So hopefully he can bounce back into the slump. All right, and definitely uh, put in work in this play. Another guy I'm looking at, Jordan Lupto against Detroit. Cleveland's in a good spot for it today. 28 is a cheap spot on FanDuel. Looking about uh, 47 on DraftKings with Luke though. But 11.2 projection play, best hit against lefties, and he's Daniel Norris Hor versus against righties. I mean, righties and lefties in general, but still a cheap spot to target on uh, FanDuel. 19 last game against them, so hopefully he has another bounce back game and put in that heat again. So still cheap on FanDuel prices, and I love them in this spot. So if you like my plays, feel free to give me a thumbs up. Any questions or concerns with your lines, feel free to comment below. As you can see, using Draft Dashboard Tools and the link in my description, all you have to do is click on the link, sign up. It's only a dollar for 30 days. You can do a lot for a dollar, y'all, so why not cash? All right, once you just click on the link and sign up, click on your menu bar, you have access to your top paid plays, your MLB cheat sheet if you don't want to spend on... Uh, spend time on research it breaks it down for the best plays for the top tier mid tier and also the low cheap spots y'all so look at your sleepers and your studs as well and click on the watch players to get access to my plays this is your custom player pool y'all so click on watch Mel's DFS picks up top you want access to my plays for either draft kings or fan duel all right so i love y'all man y'all collect that bag have a great sunday i love y'all and have a great day Say bye. <laughs> Say bye bye. Say bye bye. All right, y'all. Peace.